this is Greg Ruiz, Senior Worldwide Web Tools Evangelist at Adobe. You know the expression, time is money? Well, in the web industry, that's especially true. And during the next few minutes, I'll show you how new features in Fireworks CS4 can save you money by saving you time and making you more productive. I'm sure you'd agree that one of the biggest bottlenecks in a modern web workflow happens as we move from the page composition to an actual standards-based web page. We can also agree that most designs begin in Photoshop, as is the case here. I've laid out my page, and now I'm ready to begin the process of building the HTML. But in order to do that, in the past, we've had to then begin the process of slicing up the document. And in Photoshop, that's a manual process. Drawing out slice by slice, identifying it, optimizing it, exporting it, and then needing to put it all back together by hand. Instead, let's use Fireworks CS4. In Fireworks CS4, I can open that very same PSD file, the native Photoshop file, unchanged from Photoshop. And as I do so, you'll see that we've actually understood everything there is to know about that Photoshop document exactly as it appeared over in Photoshop, even down to the three slices that we'd already created in the Photoshop document. Now, I'm going to continue to slice this, but I'm going to do it here in Fireworks because it's a little bit faster. You see, I can simply shift select the individual elements that I'm interested in. And since this text is using a non-standard font, let's make that images as well. I'm going to then right-click to actually say to Fireworks that I would like multiple slices to be created at one time. Now that I've done so, I can select the individual slices that I'm interested in, for example these, and to specify that they should all become JPEGs, whereas the other three pieces of text will go out as a GIF. Now having done all of this, I'm ready to export. Again, I could export this by going to my file menu and choosing the export command and exporting this out not as HTML and images because that would be an old school way of doing things. I could export it as images only, but then I'd have to put it all back together by hand. Instead, I'm going to jumpstart my production by choosing another option, CSS and images. You see, in Fireworks CS4, we've overhauled the export command for CSS and images. I want to create a new folder to demonstrate that for you. I'm just going to put all of the things together in this folder and get organized, put my images into their own folder, and choosing export. Now, what Fireworks has now done is exported a HTML page for me. Let's just show that to you very quickly. We'll head over in onto the Finder or our desktop where you can see that we've actually got a folder created with HTML and an external CSS file. Let's first take a look at the HTML by double-clicking on it, and we see here in our browser, hey, it looks exactly like it did back over inside of Fireworks. And each of these individual pieces, yes, they are individual pieces, as you can see. They've been exported as images. But the new and improved export has left this as real live text. Now I'm sure you're dying to see the code. So let's go look at the code in Dreamweaver CS4. In the design view, that it looks exactly as it did over inside of Fireworks. Each of the images, of course, individual elements and real text. But if we go to the code view, that's where it gets most interesting because Fireworks has actually generated good, clean HTML markup that has com been combined with CSS. And we can look at that CSS that Fireworks has generated as well. And we can see there's not a single absolutely positioned element. This is all good, clean, standards-based markup. Now, this is not to say that using Fireworks means that I'll no longer have to write HTML and CSS by hand. That's not the point. The point was for me to move my workflow further along because there's still going to be tweaks that I'm going to want to do and need to do inside of Dreamweaver CS4. But I'm sure you'll agree. Taking the time to move through fireworks has actually saved me time in the long run and made me much more productive. And to learn more about fireworks CS4 and how it can help you save time and money, please visit adobe.com slash fireworks. <laughs>